Hey guys, Dragon here, and welcome back to Destiny, and today we're going to do a double review, actually, of A, the Twilight Garrison. It's actually a pretty cool chess piece for Titan. It has tactical air support. If you press circle, or if you're on Xbox B twice in airborne, you can evade in any direction you would like. Uh, mine has special ammo, heavy, intellect, discipline, void stuff. Then also we're going to be reviewing the Badger CCL. And mine has Icarus, explosive rounds, and reactive reload. In the middle column I could also choose feather mag or rifle barrel. I personally like explos explosive rounds. And today I am joined by Quinn. He is also using the Badger CCL and Twilight Garrison. This Badger hey there. is nice. Okay, well, shall we get started? All right. I've never thought of using the Twilight Garrison and a scout rifle together. Why, may I ask? Just because, I don't know. I personally usually prefer to run armamentarium if I'm gonna run a chess piece, because I'm all about throwing all the grenades. See, I would too, except I don't have year two armamentarium, so. Yeah. Fair. But with the right team, we can punch through those defenses. Take this beast out and break their grip on food. Some Vanguard reputation boosters. Yeah, so if for Badger CCL, if you're not familiar with it or if you haven't used it, it's like um, Call of Vance's duty and. Um, is it like the. I want to say it's like the Jade Rabbit, am I right? Yes, the trade yeah. This is another the, scout rifle. Yeah. That the, archetype. It's a slow fire rate, high impact. That kind of. I think Jade Rabbit is kind of the. Kind of mother of all the slow fire rate, high impact ones. But yeah. Well, that's just because it's exotic, though. Exactly. And grenade. Jeez, I cannot aim right now. Uh, Jesus, where are my teammates? I'm coming. The other dude died. Like I just died? Oh. Dang, look at all that. You don't even know how much heavy ammo just dropped for me. Yeah, so if you guys do not know, my main is actually a hunter, so. so. Uh. One of my least favorite enemies in this entire game is the Tekken Centurions. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I guess my least favorite would have to be probably the either the scions or the frickin phalanxes. Oh, I don't mind the phalanxes because if you can get around them, you're fine. But the scions and the centurions are pretty bad. Yeah, 
I don't know what possessed them to make such a terrible enemy. Like... I don't know. It's not even that hard, it's just irritating. Yeah. Well... <sighs> See ya, pal. <sighs> slice. Slice, slice, slice. So yeah, personally I'd really like the Badger CCL. This is actually probably one of my first times using it. That I remember anyway. I just boosted in the wrong direction, but you know. <laughs> I've always liked the higher impact, lower rate of fire scout rifles. Also, if you get triple tap on this thing, it's really nice. That is... This, I'd say triple tap on any scout rifle is pretty nice. Yeah, because it basically... It effectively doubles your magazine if you're good with Getting your headshots. Getting headshots. Yeah. I mean, PvE, I mean the... Sorry, not PvE, PvP. Um, any of these high-impact scout rifles, I believe, are three-shot headshots. And I think four-shot yes, body shots. Three shot headshots. Um, four to five shot body shots, I think, depending on. Four to five head. shot body fought shots. Body thoughts. You know when, you know when you just can't English, man. Yep, I've had that multiple times. Haha, <laughs> burning hell. <laughs> Speaking of burning in hell, so Dragon, what do you think is going to be in this upcoming expansion that's going to be? somewhat relatively soon coming um, this fall. From what leaks I've seen from other like from what I've seen of other YouTube videos or whatnot. Personally I would love there to be a uh, freaking um, Cabal DLC. I think they need one. Yeah, I think that would be cool. You know what? I was playing uh, Call of Duty the other day, some older Call of Duties with my friends, and it made me think how amazing Destiny would be if you had like private matches which you could like manipulate. Oh. Because we were playing, we were playing game modes where, like, we we're playing sticks and stones, and oh, nice. Yeah. If you could like do play something one in like the chamber that or something. Yeah, if you could do like something like that, like one in the chamber with sidearms or something, where like kinda similar to SWAT in Halo. I mean I mean Honestly I think I think just customization with 
in custom matches would be fun in Destiny overall. So. Yeah. Because, I mean, right now, the only way to do something like that would be, um... Is, uh... You have to get everybody to agree on it. And then if somebody hits the wrong button... Not exactly. It's, um... Oh, damn, I just got nailed. Anyway. What the... Um, the only way to do, like, private matches in Destiny is, um... You get two people, two fire team leaders that are that live relatively close to each other. They start up at the same time. You wait to see if you're paired up with that guy. With the other team, if you are good, if you're not, then go well, back up, try again. Yeah. But it would be nice if you didn't have to do that. Yeah, it would be, but you're kind of forced to. I just Twilight garrisoned out of the way of one of the tank shots. I've been doing that for a while, so I mean, doesn't surprise me. That's why Twilight garrison is so effective. Yeah, it's useful, but a lot of people would say that it's relatively situational. Yeah, just kind of like the um, Hunter Super. It's useful, but it's extremely situational. Yeah. What's in- Wow. I'm pretty sure that tank just shot me and the explosion hit itself. I gotcha, Quinn. If you think about it, Titans have a lot of exotic armor pieces that basically give them things that other classes have in their subclasses. Yeah, and yet there's something, and there's hunters don't really have that. So, you know. Yeah, and so as a Titan, you sort of get more ability, more like possibilities for abilities than yeah. you would as any other class, simply because of the exotic. Yep, that's why there are so many Specific. titans right now. I thought there were so many titans because of Hammer of Soul when that... Titan King came out, so everybody switched to titan, and yep. now they're just sort of sticking with it because they're too lazy to change. That plus the Which fact that, I thought was cheap. that you have a shit ton of abilities to go off of. Choose so. from. Yeah. Yeah. Armor sure. pieces, anyway. Like, the only things Titans really don't have are the, uh, gunsmith weapons. Titans have pretty shitty versions of those. Um, I personally don't find them very useful. Have you seen but, the auto uh, rifle with the good person in Crucible? Yeah, but just from my perspective, yeah. I don't do very well with them. Yeah, I mean, I mean, like for example, like I'm not like trying to name, but um, if you were to watch uh, Mr. Fruit's review of the gun, he basically went unbroken with it in a PvP match. Mhm. Mm so then again, you know, he's one of those people that loves auto rifles. So yeah. Yeah. One door closed. There we go. Part 2 will be coming soon, guys.